Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm stressed because I've been wanting to change my hair for quite some time. I haven't known what to do. Um, I'm just over it. I recently did a video where I went darker on my roots and I will link that right here. But I don't know, with summer coming up, I've just really been craving a change and I went back and forth between cutting my hair quite a few times and I'm gonna do it. And you guys are gonna be here with me through the journey. So I'm gonna show you what it looks like down and then I'm gonna straighten it and then we're just gonna get started. This is where we are lengthwise and I think I'm gonna go here which is gonna be fucking crazy and I'm extremely nervous but I'm ready it'll be so much lighter um, I finally grew my hair out to be all one length which I've been doing for years and years because I had a lot of layers my freshman year of college so as it grew out um, the front was always like a vast difference but I've finally gotten it to all one length so I think that all one length like right here maybe a little shorter oh my god I don't know okay we're just gonna do it fuck it it's hair it grows back I'm one of those people that has an emotional attachment to my hair but I want to do it and I know that if anything goes wrong and if I like went to someone to do it I would just be like really dramatic and cry and yeah if I fuck up I have no one to blame but myself so after all that very long nervous introduction let's get started all right so my hair is straightened I'm starting with the back and I've just put two ponytails here to really control my cuts so they're not like crazy. Um, but I'm trying to see if they're even, which this is, feels higher now actually. I feel like that's even. Ugh. So yeah, I'm trying to be cautious and start with just, what is this? Three inches, I'd say. Two and a half, three and work my way up because I can always cut more off. I cannot put it back on my head. So we're just gonna start. I did it. That is a lot. Oh my god. Okay, you guys are probably thinking I'm so dramatic and like it's not a lot, but like that's definitely actually like four inches maybe. <sighs> okay. I'm putting that in the trash. Let's do the second one. Oh fuck, how do I do this now with my left hand? Jack, What's up? can you do this one? What do you want me to do? I just need you to do this one. I don't know how. Just below the hair tie, make it straight. Fuck, Mac. Thank you. That's same straight, is it not? Is the other one straight? No. I mean, I can't really tell. We love husbands who help us in times of need. I want to help us better. Cool, thank you. Ooh, sorry. Okay, so I'm gonna show you the back really quick. My battery's about to die, so we're gonna have to take a pause. This is where we are. Oh my God, I've never had to reach for my ends, it's always just like down here. That is crazy. Okay, I don't know if I should take it out first or try to match. 
I don't know. I'm gonna charge my battery, I'll be right back. Okay, so I just did the front. This is where we are. I think I want to cut another inch off. I just feel like if I'm gonna do it, then I need to just really do it. Um, and I've really been liking that haircut recently. So I think I wanna cut just a little bit more off. Um, but this is what we're looking like. Obviously it's just like pin straight, really fluffy. My roots are greasy. I'm gonna take a shower and like style it and show it for you guys at the end. Hopefully the back doesn't look like shit. That's the real question. And what I will be calling my husband in to check on because if it's like not, I'm gonna need to redo it. So um, I basically just repeated that same kind of process. I let the back out and I'll show you for this next section when I go shorter, but so I left the back section out and I brushed my hair and I just took the scissors and very carefully cut a straight line. So that's what we're gonna do again. We're gonna do the exact same thing. And then I just, let me get the other one in real quick. All right, and then I'm just gonna slide them down. And try to make them meet. This one's gonna be a lot harder because before my hands were like down here and it was a lot easier. Now I'm kind of having to like really stretch, which sucks. So I feel like that's how much more I want, is just this right here. Oh, so now I need to make these meet. Which I hope they do. I'm gonna use my phone and check it to see if they match. Okay, so to me it looks like they're pretty even. So I'm gonna go ahead and make that next cut, which again, is a lot more difficult this time around. So I'm just gonna try to stay as straight as possible. Am I straight? Fuck, yes. Okay, that's about another inch and a half. So I would say, ooh, I would say cut off about five and a half inches. Five, five and a half. I am legit sweating. Like I'm, I'm ready for it and I'm excited, but I've had long hair since a very, very long time and I'm just nervous. All right, let's try this guy. My husband is out. So, we're on this one. Let me see how much is left on the bottom. Okay. Like that, and I need to be straight, which I feel like I am. This side's a lot harder to do. Oh no. I had him help me oh my god so I just have to take what out I got because I dropped it fuck all right this one might end up looking like shit now because you're ideally supposed to cut one complete cut but Wow, that was actually super straight. I don't know if you guys can see that. It looks kind of crooked because of the way I'm holding it, but. Yeah. Okay. And then I'm just gonna. Oh, she was not straight. Holy shit. This one was awesome. 
That one I did so good. There's like little flurries, but that guy is rough. So I'm just gonna hold him and I'm not gonna like stretch the hair tie at all. Um, we're just gonna do it over the sink. Let me. And I'm just gonna try to fix this. like one piece okay that one feels a lot straighter now so same thing just gonna drop these make sure this one's straight up oh, and there's just i want to get these like scraggly hairs Oh my god, I'm so stressed. I'm so hot. Okay. Round two. Frankie! My dog's freaking out. So I'm just gonna base stuff where this is and where this is make it meet. And then for this part, I'm gonna wait and save the fronts until the very, very end because I really don't wanna mess up on this. This is like what I'm gonna have to look at every day. So I'm gonna be a lot slower with that. This side here, same thing. I just have the fronts that I need to meet. All right, you guys, ah, this is the final result. It is literally, literally the exact length that I wanted it to be and I thought about straightening my hair and I've also been on a natural hair journey um trying to wear my hair naturally wavy but one thing I'm always like kind of iffy on with short hair and one of the reasons it took me so long to do this is because of the way it looks on my head curly because I have really thick hair. So I was like, you know what? No, I want to see if it looks good curled because that's honestly what's going to make or break how I feel about this haircut. And oh, guys, I'm so much happier than I thought I was going to be at the start of this. Like I was sweating in so much pain mentally. I was like, this is going to be such a mistake. I'm going to have to go to the salon. I'm going to be bald. No, it, oh, it literally is exactly what I wanted. So don't try this at home unless you're really confident. I also just need to put a disclaimer in here that I did go to cosmetology school and I do have my cosmetology license. So I wasn't going into this uneducated. I did have a rhyme and a reason for everything I did. But again, you know, when you're cutting hair on yourself, especially when it's short, it is really, really difficult. So I'm honestly just gonna stare at myself for like two days straight because I cannot believe that I pulled this off. I really can't. Damn. Go me! High five. Killed it. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you end up cutting your hair at home, I pray for you. You can do this, be careful, and let me know how it goes for you if you do end up doing it at home. So if you are not already, go ahead and subscribe. Join my fam over here. I'm still a small channel, so I would really, really appreciate the support. And again, if you like this, give it a thumbs up. That is great for me and my little channel. I'll catch you guys in my next one. Thanks, bye.